Um, actually, this is an old piece. Actually, I got as big of an applause as um, Ann Waldman did the night that I read this, uh, New Year's of 2012, though so nobody kissed my ass after it. Um, it's called Sold Streets. Did you know that the city only exists in the eye of the projector? Its film is becoming far too thin and ready to crumble and the streets are sold. The projectionist is on the way out. He found an eviction notice on his door this morning. The beauty queen of Glamour magazine, 1983, now lives under the scaffolding of 91st Street beneath the thumb of AIDS. But the tides of good fortune could not carry her away far enough from the streets and sidewalks and rooming houses which are exposed when the pools of fame run dry. Now she wears the face of disease, disease which came on like beauty's final curse, as vicious as a female praying mantis on Broadway. Here ruin presses against the skin, leaving its mark like a fingerprint on still glass. Under the watch of Millionaire's Row of West 86th Street, the Dexter House does not sit quietly. Its children not on, know only night, waking at four in the afternoon to walk as silent shadows who pass by on Riverside Drive to sustain the winds off the Hudson River, which beats against their sides as an invisible friend. Most live with winters at uh, in their hearts as the disgrace of landlords running unchecked grows as a decaying threat while others perform at penny arcades all have given up looking for something to keep clean in cleansing fire. Those who live behind the, these section doors are often forgotten by time while replacing sleep with the voices down the hall where bathrooms doors sit open uh, waiting for the next casualty. Wanda is, Wanda is frantic again, looking for the soul that she lost in a downtown Brooklyn bar where it still lies, stained by the boots of those squatters she once laid. In this, <clears throat> excuse me, in the side of the city, empty storefronts sprout like cattails over a polluted heart, with for rent signs pressed against their windows. Housing court has become a collection agency for the landlords, judges are nothing more than overpaid clerks. There is no defense for SRO tenants, working class, regular apartment tenants, squatters, or Section 8 tenants. Witnesses to the great crimes of iron jaw landlords pass by with deep seated contempt or fish eyed indifference, then vanish from memory as they reach the end of the set. Thank you.